uh, the one that you did. Yeah, it's one of my favorite experiences, actually. Cinderella Man. Yeah, and the story of Braddock, I mean, that's an amazing story. Great story. Incredible story. Yeah. We had met, like, funny resistance here with the release that the people couldn't get their heads around the fact that a movie called Cinderella Man was about a boxer. <laughs> Fucking America. <laughs> it, was just, it was like, really? It's, that's it, funny. It's, it's that hard to get? Uh, yeah. And Maybe it was it's a like cl- classic thing. Cinderella story is a thing that is yeah, always used in sports. Yeah, she's supposed to be a chick, right? But it's used for men <laughs> in sports all the time. Well, it, that's it. Was it was some famous uh, American writer, Damon Runyon or whatever, who coined the phrase. Mm-hmm. You know, he wrote that. You know, the story of James J., James J. Braddock is a Cinderella story. Yeah, that's where he got the the nickname. You know, but I I just you know sometimes you're playing characters that you don't really rate as a person or whatever or you know sometimes you're playing very negative characters you know earlier this year i did um a nuremberg where i played Hermann goering and um, so that's going to be coming out soon um looking forward to people seeing that but braddock was a, a such an experience man because everything that i read about him the stories i heard about him i just liked him more and more you know which can be a bit of a dangerous thing as a an actor, I try not to fall in love with the character. I, you know, what I say is I'm in love with the job. You know, mm-hmm. so if my, my, my job is to show you who that person is, whether it's positive or negative. You know, um, uh, because it's kind of weird. You know, you, you can't fall in love with Hitler. You know what I mean? <laughs> <Sort of> like, <laughs> if you're playing that role, you know what I mean? So yeah. It's sort of like um, 